Prince Andrew, once a prominent member of the British monarchy, finds himself on the brink of losing everything. King Charles III, fed up with his brother's antics and the burden he places on the royal purse, is reportedly preparing to evict Andrew from the lavish royal lodge. Meanwhile, the late Queen Elizabeth II's final days were marked by a rejection of Meghan Markle's audacious request to claim ownership of Windsor, further complicating the royal narrative. For nearly two decades, Prince Andrew has resided in the opulent Royal Lodge, a property valued at approximately $38 million, nestled within the grounds of Windsor Castle. This grand estate, once home to their grandmother, the Queen Mother, has become a symbol of Andrew's fall from grace. After stepping back from royal duties in 2019 due to his controversial ties to convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein, Andrew's reputation has been irreparably tarnished. His friendship with Epstein and subsequent allegations of sexual misconduct have left him ostracized from royal duties and public life, leading to a significant loss of status and respect. King Charles, who has been footing the bill for Andrew's private security, an expense that reportedly costs around $4 million annually, has grown increasingly impatient with his brother's refusal to downsize to a more modest residence, such as Frogmore Cottage, which remains empty after Prince Harry and Meghan Markle vacated it. Sources close to the royal family indicate that Charles is determined to resolve what has been internally dubbed the Andrew problem, and is prepared to take drastic measures if necessary. Despite the mounting pressure, Andrew remains stubbornly attached to Royal Lodge, seemingly oblivious to the reality of his situation. Described as a prisoner of his own pride, Andrew's refusal to leave has become a point of contention within the family. Royal experts suggest that Charles's attempts to persuade Andrew to vacate the property have been met with resistance, leading to a stalemate that has left the king beyond frustrated. The irony of Andrew's predicament is palpable. Once a prince with a promising future, he now clings to a home that symbolizes his disgrace. His daughters, Princess Beatrice and Princess Eugenie, have expressed their discontent over their father's situation, but their pleas seem to fall on deaf ears as Andrew remains entrenched in his lavish lifestyle. As Prince Andrew grapples with his impending eviction, another royal drama unfolds involving Meghan Markle. In her quest for acceptance within the royal family, Meghan reportedly made a bold request to Queen Elizabeth II shortly before her passing, she sought ownership of Windsor. However, the late Queen, known for her steadfastness and commitment to tradition, firmly rejected Meghan's impudent request, leaving the Duchess of Sussex feeling more isolated than ever. This rejection not only highlights the ongoing tensions within the royal family but also underscores the shifting dynamics as King Charles takes the throne. With Meghan's aspirations thwarted, the focus now shifts to Kate Middleton, who has emerged as a central figure in the royal family. As Andrew's fortunes dwindle, Kate's star continues to rise, positioning her as a key player in the monarchy's future. With Andrew's disgrace and Meghan's rejection, Kate Middleton stands poised to inherit not just the public's affection but potentially significant royal responsibilities. As the new Princess of Wales, Kate has embraced her role with grace and poise, winning over the hearts of the British public. Her ability to navigate the complexities of royal life while maintaining a relatable image has solidified her position as a beloved figure within the monarchy. As King Charles seeks to modernize the royal family and distance it from the scandals of the past, Kate's presence offers a fresh perspective. Her commitment to charitable work and her focus on mental health initiatives resonate with the public, contrasting sharply with Andrew's tarnished legacy. While Andrew clings to his past, Kate represents a new era for the monarchy, one that prioritizes service, compassion, and a connection to the people. The unfolding saga of Prince Andrew's downfall serves as a cautionary tale about the consequences of pride and privilege. As King Charles prepares to take decisive action against his brother, the royal family faces a reckoning that could redefine its future. With Meghan Markle's ambitions thwarted and Kate Middleton rising to prominence, the monarchy is at a crossroads. In the hallowed halls of Buckingham Palace, a storm has been brewing, one that has seen the once untouchable Prince Andrew fall from grace in a manner that has shocked the world. The latest chapter in this saga unfolds with the revelation that King Charles III has taken the unprecedented step of evicting his brother from the royal lodge a move that has sent shockwaves through the royal family and the public alike. Prince Andrew, the Duke of York, has long been a controversial figure within the royal family. His association with the late Jeffrey Epstein and the subsequent allegations of sexual misconduct have cast a dark shadow over his reputation. Despite his attempts to clear his name, including a disastrous interview with the BBC, the public's perception of the prince has remained largely negative. 
The latest blow to Prince Andrew's status comes in the form of his eviction from the Royal Lodge, a grand residence within Windsor Great Park that has been his home for many years. The decision, reportedly made by King Charles III, is seen as a clear sign that the new monarch is taking a hard line against his brother's scandals and is determined to protect the reputation of the royal family. But the story does not end there. In a twist that has added fuel to the fire, it has been revealed that the Royal Lodge will not be left empty. Instead, it is set to be inherited by none other than Kate Middleton, the Duchess of Cambridge. This move is seen as a clear endorsement of Kate's growing role within the royal family and a sign of the trust and respect she has earned from the new king. The decision to evict Prince Andrew and hand the Royal Lodge to Kate has not been without controversy. Some have argued that the move is unfair, given that Prince Andrew has not been convicted of any crime. However, others see it as a necessary step to distance the royal family from the scandals that have plagued the Duke of York. The late Queen Elizabeth II, who passed away in September 2022, is said to have played a role in the decision. According to sources close to the royal family, the Queen was deeply concerned about the impact of Prince Andrew's scandals on the monarchy and had been considering taking action against him for some time. Her death, however, left the decision in the hands of King Charles III, who has not hesitated to act. In a further twist, it has been revealed that Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex, had made an impudent request to own Windsor Castle shortly before the Queen's death. The request, which was reportedly made without the knowledge or consent of Prince Harry, was said to have been met with a firm rejection from the Queen. The incident has added to the growing tension between the Sussexes and the rest of the royal family, with many seeing it as a sign of Meghan's ambition and disregard for royal protocol. The eviction of Prince Andrew and the inheritance of the Royal Lodge by Kate Middleton is just the latest chapter in a long-running saga that has seen the royal family grappling with scandal and controversy. For Prince Andrew, the loss of his home is a bitter blow, one that has left him isolated and disgraced. For Kate, however, it is a sign of her growing influence and importance within the royal family, a role that she is said to be embracing with grace and determination. As the royal family continues to navigate the challenges of the modern world, it is clear that King Charles III is determined to take a firm hand in protecting the reputation of the monarchy. Whether this will be enough to restore public trust in the institution remains to be seen, but one thing is clear, the days of Prince Andrew's influence and power are numbered. For many, the eviction of Prince Andrew is a long overdue step, a sign that the royal family is finally taking action against the scandals that have plagued it for so long. For others, however, it is a sad end to a once promising career, a reminder of the high price that comes with royal privilege. Whatever the future holds for Prince Andrew, it is clear that his fall from grace has been swift and brutal, a cautionary tale for anyone who dares to challenge the authority of the crown. As the royal family looks to the future, it is Kate Middleton who is emerging as a beacon of hope and stability. Her inheritance of the royal lodge is just the latest sign of her growing influence and importance, a role that she is said to be embracing with grace and determination. For the public, Kate's ascension is a welcome development, a sign that the royal family is finally moving in the right direction.